Hi Digmates, it's Dominique, Head of Communications at Digma. We just released the new base core and firmware version with the latest improvements. You can download the latest base core version 0.2.7 in the link in the description below. And please don't forget to update your firmware once you've downloaded base core so that all the new features and the bug fixes can be applied to your keyboard. So what were the new improvements that we made with this new version? First, we fixed the freezing issue and turned it into three second resets. You can read more about our four step plan to tackle this issue in our blog. And I'll put the link in the description below as well. Another thing that we improved is the instructions in the firmware update process. One of our digmates gave us feedback about his experience during the whole firmware update process. So we decided to modify and simplify the instructions so that more people can understand it clearly and we would have less people getting confused. Hopefully the instructions now are better. Besides modifying the instructions, users are no longer required to put their LEDs into rainbow mode. When you click update firmware, the LEDs on your race will automatically turn into rainbow mode. Besides those improvements, we also fixed a few bugs. We fixed a bug that was found on Linux operating systems that didn't let base core start properly. We also improved the input lag when you put your keyboard into rainbow mode. And the last thing we did was we added a firmware hibernation support where your race keyboard would also sleep if you put your computer to sleep or hibernate. So that's it. Thanks for tuning in. If you have any questions or feedback, feel free to comment below. We'll continue to update the community with all our developments through our YouTube videos. So make sure you subscribe and of course, click the bell icon so that you can receive notifications every time we publish a new video. Catch you later, guys.